successful businesswoman. Let's start! <laughs> Hero, Mary Seacole. Who is she, Raya? I know. Mary Seacole was a British Jamaican businesswoman and a nurse who was most famous for setting up the British Hotel to care for Indian British soldiers behind enemy lines during the Crimean War. Oh, I've heard of the Crimean War because at school we learned about Mary Seacole. Right, guys. Before we get into this video, I need you to do one little thing right now. Make sure you smash the thumbs up and subscribe the button down below. in 1805 in Kingston, Jamaica. Her mother was Jamaican and a doctress and her father was Scottish and an officer in the British Army. Mary was taught traditional Caribbean and African herbal medicines by her mother at her boarding house, Blundell Hall. Mary first travelled to England in 1821 when she was only 16 years old. She went back to Jamaica shortly to get some jams and pickles to sell in England. Starting her career as a successful businesswoman. Let's start! <laughs> There was a terrible outbreak as a disease called cholera in Jamaica. Luckily, Mary Seco made a medicine so then they could help them. Mary began to study the disease with the help of a military doctor and learned a lot how to treat those infected. She later treated a terrible epidemic of cholera on a crusade on the Isthmus of Panama. The Crimean War between the English and the Russians broke out in October 1853. The next year, Mary arrived in London and offered her skills as a nurse to the British Army. Mary was told that, unfortunately, all the nurse's position has been filled. However, Mary was determined to help the soldiers. So she paid to go to Crimea with her friend, Thomas Day. They opened the British Hotel, a hotel and a store, a few miles where the soldiers were stationed in Balaklava, Crimea, so that she could cheat injured or ill soldiers. Mary didn't only cheat soldiers in the British Hotel, in fact, she would visit the front lines of the war, bringing sandwiches, drinks, bandages and medicine with her for the soldiers. Mary helped British, French and Sardinian soldiers who were all allies in the war, but she also tended to the Russian soldiers, even though she was technically with the enemy. Even though she was well loved, Mary's story was lost into history. Florence Nightingale, another nurse, during the Crimean War, who had even worked with Zika once, she became much more famous as a Crimean War nurse. During the 1980s, Mary's story was rediscovered. Nowadays, a statue of Mary Seacole 
stand outside St Thomas's Hospital in London. It was believed to be the first statue honouring a black woman in Britain. Mary Seacole's story is very inspiring guys. It shows you that no matter who you are, if you are determined, you can do anything. For all the work Mary Sue has done, she'll always be our hero and right beside us. But not right beside you, but pretend you're like in heaven. Like a, I don't know, an angel? Like, pretend, like, imagine she's behind you every day, helping you when you're sick. She's right behind you. Well, right next to you. Just pretend. I hope you enjoyed this video on Mary Sue Pearl, guys. And that's all we have time for today. But unfortunately guys, we have run out of time and I hope you enjoyed this video on Kids Black History. And I'll see you in the next video guys. Bye guys. But wait, make sure you smash the thumbs up and subscribe to the button down below. And don't forget out to check out all our other episodes of Kids Black History. And don't forget to, don't, and don't forget to check out Ray of Fuckplay as well. And bye guys. Bye guys. Peace.